morning everybody morning. and welcome back to another day with us for some reason it feels like my seat may have dropped because um i'm gone is that up or down? down i'm moving myself down so up there we go i'm up um the seatbelt seems to be bothering me again but i have bought seatbelt covers and they are coming today but we're going out before they come so um Tomorrow they will be there. They will be there tomorrow, yeah, or later on. Um, we're going on. We're going yeah. on a big drive today. We're doing a motorway. Ew. And you know what? I'm not as nervous as I thought I would be. Probably because last night, as a little um, practice run, we went up to Asda on the motorway, didn't we? See your cars? As we could say the same thing about our kids. They're all in shorts. We're not walking with a big thick duffel coat on. Yeah, but at least he's got a coat on because you know, people don't feel cold on the legs when you're in school. You wear shorts and skirts, don't you? Yeah, so. I get cold. But anyway, yeah, we're going on. We went last night to Asda on the motorway and it went too bad. So we're doing the motorway again today to Wigan. Is it Wigan? Yeah. We're going to this park that has a farm in it. The more I'm talking about it, the more I can feel the nerves like slowly yeah. creeping in. But no, we're fine. Fine. We're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Absolutely fine. Tried a new style out with me hair because I'm absolutely sick to death of it. Look on a show and the wind blow and all of those little bits. I think I showed it in the beach vlog the other day where all my hair's growing back after having Nevea. I lost loads of hair having Nevea, didn't I? Yeah. I also lost loads of hair when I got my blood clot on my lung and I was taking um those blood thinning injections for a while it like made me teeth crumble it made me hair all fall out it was horrible it was really horrible um and then i didn't realize how much hair i'd actually lost until it started growing back and even when my hair was tied up i had like it was it reminded me of when i had a fringe when i was kids my fringe started from back here somewhere i don't know why my mother did that to me but she did so i decided last night to practice run these braids in my hair so do i look like a child she was like no and then this morning i woke up and i was like i look like a child but it keeps the hair out of my face it's a new style let's roll with it see how it goes didn't see me. at the old man yeah. because you've got blacked out windows that's why i haven't oh the kids have that it's just because um he was concentrating. Yeah. Anyway, let's go. just said we did oh i haven't taken my engine off that's great isn't it we did it didn't we but what did we forget nevaeh nevaeh shoes we've come up far away from home i have got wellies in the boot i hope i've still got them in the boot i think i've got them in the boot if not nevaeh's doing a lot of getting carried okay. and sitting in the pram i need to just keep sh shoes that she barely wears in the boots oh. did they have crocs to put them on no, 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 no. i mean like i need to keep different because she wears them a lot the crocs doesn't yeah. she but I did it. I went over the Runcorn Bridge. Like, no, drove all the way, yeah. We went the wrong way. And Helen, the instructor, taught me if you're ever going over a one way bridge, always beep before you're going over it to let the other people on the other side know that you're about to go over it. So I beeped, don't I? And a car comes friggin' flying towards me. They're meant to be back. Oh, yeah. And he just nearly crashed into us and then looked at us like we were the idiots, didn't he? And I was like, am I on a one way street? Yeah, I wasn't. Um, but it turns out it's the sat nav. The, the Dacia sat nav directed us to the golf course instead of the park. So, hey, Dad, did you move that clear bag? That was in the boot. It, no. What clear bag? There's a clear bag in the boot. No, We're no, everything in it. No, well, do you know what? I must be getting more comfortable with driving because my cheeks aren't as red, and I'm normally bright red. I thought you did great then. Sorry for the language. I thought you did great then. I have like, to keep really, really I, if, if, if the videos are really choppy when we're talking, it's because Joe swears and I have to like cut, chop them out. Yeah, Joe's going to punch them out. And I know like loads of people swear and like, but it's it's a family channel and kids watch us. And I know it's around our kids, but our kids know not to copy. And I wouldn't like to like influence that on other kids. So that's why I chop it out. It's not that I'm not being real, it's just that. It's not very nice, is it? 
We've got wraps, haven't we? You got your wellies. At least we have wellies. <laughs> but yeah, it wasn't. Do you know what? The motorway wasn't too bad. Um, the back roads arriving here were scarier than the motorway. Um, I don't know how I'm going to feel about coming back, about getting back on the motorway because I've never been that way, obviously. So yeah, is it? it is. Do it so. We haven't done it before we get out. So you can have a little rest. I've had, it was off. like a. a uh, Please where we can see us. Yeah, I've still got the blanket in the car, I have, haven't I? Yeah. Hey guys, hey guys. Hey guys. Oh, stop kicking at me. Mm -hmm. She's got me hair. Yeah, get off Nana's hair. Good girl. Hey mum. Um, but yeah, we've arrived. I've got to go and pay for parking as well. It's good though that we bought rallies because we're going into a farm. Mm hmm. We are. We're going into like a petting zoo. And I brought new shoes. Oh, it's all right. They're, they're wrecked. New <laughs> shoes. Stay there. Daddy's gone to the toilet. I love you, Leah. Right, Joe's gone to find the toilet. My hands are hurting. Do you know what I've noticed since I've started driving? My fingers and my hands have started hurting more. Now, I don't know if it's because of the way I have to... The going into reverse is like pull up and go like that. Me driving instructors was literally go right back into like where six gear is for me. Can I have a hug? And, um, yeah, of course. You've done like three motorways. Mm-hmm. Okay. You gotta get over your fear, haven't you? I seen a video posted this morning saying something like um I don't run at six o'clock in the morning because I enjoy running and because I'm an athlete. We do. Yeah. Yeah. Oh um, guys, I forgot the part. So mum was turning into the East Lanks Road yeah, and it was cone saying police road closed yeah. and she went away. I went, this is an easier way to get on the motorway. I've been on this way before and then as we're turning out the whole road, yeah, I don't know what's happened on East Lanks. Yeah, I think so. If anyone knows what's happened on East Lanks today, just comment down below. No, because this will be going up about three days time so we should know by then anyway. Oh, so no, no, but yeah, there's been something happened on the East Lanks. I think when I was on the motorway it looked like it was a crash. I didn't look properly though, Joe did. Um, it, with a little little lorry it looked like um well lorries aren't little are they but um i was about to go up onto the motorway and all of the ropes all coned off and this car driver that was next to us was looking at me like and i didn't even see the cones i was just like oh and then i had to do like a big 360 in the middle of the road and then go back the other way even Ooh, though we sat and i was telling me no it's like a pattern like, no, one, no one else has that but anyway um what was I saying? The video I was seeing this morning said something like he doesn't run because he's an athlete or because he enjoys running. He hates running and he hates getting up that early in the morning, but he does it because it pushes him out of his comfort zone and it pushes him past like wanting to just sit on the couch and binge eat and stuff like that. And you've got to push yourself past your comfort zone to to get to bigger places because nobody else is going to do it for you. And um he was right you have nobody else is gonna do this drive for us i'm the driver so i did it did it i'm far away it looks like i like i have and we lips. are halfway to wales from far away it looks like i have duck lips no it doesn't you've got little lips like me your top lip is like your bottom lip's fine but your top lip's a little chunky. small no a little small like mine oh. My bottom lips are only chunky because... I got my Nana's lips. My mum always used to say, you got your Nana's lips. Nana's lips. And Joe's just doing the pay and display. I think it's £3.50. This pay and display. Done. How many hours do you get? How many hours do you get? 14. So what do we do? Just stick this in the window. Use the sticker on the back to fix to the window screen. So you got to put it on the outside. Where's everybody else's? See that? Yeah, Okay. Yeah, sounds. Um, yeah, three pound fifty. Don't know how long it's for. I will check as we're going past. But the entrance is completely free, and so is the farm. It's called Walton Hall Park and Gardens in what is this Warrington? 
Warrington. Warrington. Yeah. So I just went back to the car because I noticed everybody else has used the sticker to stick it to the window. Um, well, some people have like stuck it, the, the, used the sticker to stick it to the inside of the window. So Monday to Friday, it's £3.50. Enter the last three digits of your... Did you do that? Yeah. Yeah. Enter the last three digits of your car. Vehicle owners left a risk. Oh! Help. Hours, blue yeah, free parking for three hours with a blue badge. We don't have none of that though. Um, and it doesn't really say any hours, does it? So that's it. Three pound fifty for you to to go here. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, let's follow the crowd. There doesn't seem to be a time scale that you can stay here for noted anyway but it does say three hours for disabled badges so would it be the same for ticket holders i don't know but anyway um it doesn't it doesn't state any and i'm doubt we'll be here for three hours surely not never know never know um we're just following where everybody else is going because everybody else is um walking up this way and we were walking in the opposite direction we always do that don't we <laughs> and end up in the wrong place we're just following everybody else we'll end up in the middle of nowhere now you in your wellies? No. No? She's not happy about that, is she? So you go across the bridge. I see the water too. And I see water that way too. Oh well. So, they come over here in the fair. We've got the outdoor games, woodland walk, children's zoo play area, Walton Hall function park car park. And then we go over here, over here, over here, over here, over here, over here, over here. Yeah. And also in the park. Park. So look, this used to, I was reading about this this morning actually. Um, welcome to former home and gardens of Lord and Lady, Lady Daresbury. What way are we going? Wait, and so if we go, go to the cocktail, we have to go to the entrance. We'll go whatever way. Go whatever way. Come on, Come on then. I don't want to end up in the middle of the They said that there was um, red, red something squirrels online. That's lovely. The way they look. Look, there they are, there. Look, Nevea. Look here. There they are. They're not even running away. Oh, there's loads of them. Stand back. Oh my gosh, there's loads! What are you going in They're apparently they're 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 endangered. Like so we're not Don't, allowed to you're not allowed them. to feed them now. How close they are! Alright, come on, Jeff! Amazing. This as well, which would have been perfect for Zach, because that's what he's learning about at the minute. It was £10 a ticket. Found the park. You need to go in the little house. The bay is just full of excitement, aren't you? Yeah, Mom, Do you want to get out then? Yeah. Okay. Oh, Mommy. Come on then. I want you to come see my house. Where are you going to the house? Oh, you're going on this. Yes. Go on, are you ready? Watch what it does. Ooh. Oh, mommy sits on this side. Woo! <laughs> Ladybugs. Go on. Yay. Okay, go on then. Lady, a, a bumblebee. Bumblebee. Ebony and Renee are just crawling through all of like the little holes over there. Yeah. Go on. Ah. 
<laughs> go on, go on, you can do it. Go into the slide in there. Do it. No, get up. Go on the slide, look. Let's go down the other end. Go on, I'll meet you the other end. Nevea! Nevea! I'll come up though. Hi, Nevea! <laughs> Wrong child. It is. You weren't dead fast. Ebony's making a wish in the wishing well. Hey, look, there's a fun fair here as well. It must be closed today, but. Well, I was going to help Nevaeh up the slide that her bum's wet. Now, again, her nappies have never ever leaked. And suddenly, the last, there was Southport and this one. A um, bum's been wet, and I don't know if it's the nappies. She doesn't smell like pee, or if she spilt milk in a car seat again. Which means now I've got to wash the car seat. So I'm heading back to the car to go and get another nappy because Joe forgot to bring one and a spare pants and a wipes because Joe forgot them too. So they're all in the car and I'm walking back to the car. I got the squirrels here are like tame. They come up to you. Yeah? I've just seen some kids standing there while one was like right on his feet. <laughs> My kids have crapped themselves. <laughs> They're used to the ones by us biting. Just everywhere. They were in the playing park. Just, just everywhere. Back to the car now. I'm heading into the park. Um, a seat wasn't wet. So either a nappy's moved while we've been out here or she's sat on something wet in this play area. Maybe. I don't know. Doubt it wasn't actually a nappy at all, so she must have just sat in something wet on one of those mm -hmm. little. It was like a pocket when I felt it. All of the insides of her pants and everything were completely dry. I just changed the nappy anyway, oh, just in case. Oh, but, <laughs> so, because I like taking your seat, Dad, just come to have a picnic in the park because there's picnic benches, isn't there? Which is just great. And we are surrounded by ducks and squirrels, <laughs> which is just mental, isn't it? Because ducks like right behind us, just, just here on the grass. Where are they? Yeah. Oh, they're over there. Let me just see if I can get them in without showing the people. Just lean back a little bit. No, no, I can't see you. I don't want to get everybody else. Hi. Okay. I don't want to get everybody else in, so I can't really show you, but there's ducks and squirrels. There's the duck. Her taking a big bite since that she normally hates bread, doesn't she? But since we've been going out, she loves bread. Got our own squirrel fest going on. Look at them all. As if we are sitting this close to squirrels. Yeah, we can't even get within a mile of them round by ours, can we? No. We cannot believe how close these squirrels are to us. What's that? It does a wasp on that box there. I can't Joe. Now. I don't know what that animal was making that noise, but uh, <laughs> it does. Um, I can't believe how close these squirrels are to us. Like our yeah. ones in our area just run away from us the second we step even an inch close to them. Oh, Joe, that wasp, where's it gone? It was on your arm. And them Nevea. Yeah. Squirrels. Yeah. Bye bye, squirrels. And we're going to go into the children's zoo. No dogs allowed in here, and they do not encourage feeding the animals because it might make them bite. What? And there's a zoo it's wishing a well. It's a right there. Oh, okay, it's a rooster. I a rooster. Ah. Okay. Oh, you want a penny? Yeah. Go in there. Find your pennies. Give the penny. Give, oh, give yeah. you one each. There should be a couple. I've got a lot of change. Can we pick you up so you can get it? Ready? One, two, three, in the hole! Yay! Do you want to put it in? Yay! Let's go! 
A chunky bunny. Is he a chunky bunny? Oh God, and a big. duck. Oh wow, he is big, isn't he? He's yeah. your favourite animal, isn't it, Eb? Oh, he is huge. He's a big boy. Yeah? You don't take them home now. Yeah, this way. We're going up this way, Nevaya. Oh, we, we should have brought yours, shouldn't we? Yeah. Look in here. There's mice. There's mice. This is the education centre. Oh, that's a rat. That's not. Oh no, they're chinchillas, aren't they? Oh no, to go. They're not rats. No. They look like rats. They're probably be part of the rat family. Yeah, he's in his house. Look at him, he's sniffing us. Hello. Say hello. They do look like little rats, but they are Dago from Chile. Lifespan six to eight years. Wild Dago's can only be found in forest areas of Chile. They live in large groups of up to 90 Dago's and dig extensive burrows from forming from digging chain so everybody helps out. Like lizards, they shed their tails. Ooh, if grabbed by predators. It's interesting, isn't it? Oh, they've got hamsters. Yeah, hamsters. There are 24 species of hamsters. Most of the common are Syrian, Russian, Dwarf and Robuscuffy. Robuscuffy? Robuscuffy? Can't say that word. Hamsters are nocturnal and some... Well, it's the nocturnal, which means they're only awake for the night time. So... And they live between one to two years. Wow. And that's a gerbil. Gerbils are domestic gerbils were first discovered in eastern Mongolia in 1867. Yes. Hey, are you shot and squirrel? That's not a squirrel. Mommy, yeah. Me. He's not a squirrel. He's a dagoo. No, oh, he's green. He's running around, isn't he? He's having fun. Yeah. <laughs> Cute. And there's all of the rabbits that they've had on here. And the sheep. The donkey having its dentist check. Vet, vet vaccinations for sheep. Shearing the sheep. Paul the blacksmith, he does all of the donkeys' feet every six weeks. Yeah. Schools come in too. And look, you can walk the alpacas. Cool, one, isn't it? Look at that. What is it? Get their hair cut to keep them cool. This is called cheering. What's that got to do with this little boy? Oh, he's cute, isn't he? He's a big seagull, Ben. And it's got oh, its, it's um, wings spread. Wow. Look at that. Look, get the chair. I would if it was the right way. It turned around as I got to it. Wow. Hopefully it turns around so it shows us its feathers. This one. The beautiful one. Remember aunty? when I told you that I saw a peacock in that little field one yeah, time? That was a feather. It was, it was a oh, it's turned around. Look. How gorgeous is that? Mum, that's what I saw. I mean, that's what I saw. Did you? Yeah. Aren't they gorgeous? Why is it so big? They're not camels, love. Ebony. They're not camels, they're alpacas. <laughs> Mommy, why is it so big? Why has it got eyes on its back? I don't know. I think they're called Turkish eyes. I can't remember. What we'll have to look at it, won't we? Yeah, did you know? Our zoo has several crossbreeds of hen. 
These are from Eastern Asia. So the, the chickens. Did you take a picture of them? That are in here. Yeah. That is pygmy goat. Oh, God. Yeah. They're called peafowl. Peacocks. And they're from India. <laughs> Only the males have the long, bright feathers and it is to attract a mate so they can have babies. The one with the and look, it says peahens, female peacocks, can tell which male is the strongest and healthiest by its magnificent display. <laughs> and it will choose the lucky peacock to father its chicks. Peahens are dull brown. So this one here, this is a female peahen. Peahens are dull brown, which helps camouflage them when they are sat on their eggs. Likewise, their chicks are sandy colour when they are born. And they can fly just hours after hatching. Mommy, so this see, one's a female. And those gorgeous looking ones is males. Female. Male. No. She has to be that colour to protect her babies, so not and tries to attack her. She looks like a uh, attack her. She looks like sand when she's sitting. Look at him! Duck! <laughs> Literally duck! <laughs> It come flying in our head, so do you get it, duck? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then you've got your pygmy goats. Should we have a look at what the pygmy goats say? Oh, they're turkeys, them ones. That's turkey facts. Here we go. These little goats live in the mountains of Africa. They are very agile and can quickly scale steep mountains for a quick escape from predators. So Billy Goats are the boys and nannies are the females. Nanny! Mm -hmm. Nanny! And they live 10 to 12 years. Oh. So like They're all just like... chilled, aren't they? Our one's an acorn farm ride down slides and everything, don't they? Yeah. And then there's a slide there. Oh yeah, look. Look at him just chilling on a slide. Because you're beautiful. Oh look, the peacock in there. Just there, yeah. He's flew over here. Oh, hi. Where did he just well. come from? Should he can't fly. Oh, that one doesn't look for me. That's there. Look at him cleaning himself. He's gorgeous, isn't he? Oh, look, look at him in his little hut. Look at the rabbit. Cute. Oh, he's gorgeous, isn't he? He's a big one. Is that a rooster that? Oh, look at the alpacas. Oh, okay. Look at these. Ebony. These alpacas. Oh, look at them. Yeah. Oh, look, they're getting excited because they know that they're going for the dinner. Yeah. Oh, this is so cute. Look at that. Wow. Wow. That one just takes it slow. Like, okay, I'll wait for my food. Look, they've gone for the dinner. Gorgeous, aren't they? You're having the dinner? <laughs> They're roosters. That's why they've got them. Are they hen? Rooster. Look, they're all getting the dinner today. Oh, yeah? Whoa, they're all excited. <laughs> It is literally feeding time at the zoo. <laughs> feeding time at the zoo. Oh yeah, we can go on. Hi, did you see them? Did you see them going to have their dinner? They're chickens. Oh yeah. 
golden pheasant. The cool them. Are they rare, are they? Yeah, cool. Golden pheasants live in forests in China. Males are incredibly colourful, while females are a bit drab in appearance. In other words, all mothers sacrifice how they look for their young. Red breasted. What is it? A red breasted goose. A red breasted goose. That is lovely, isn't it? I love them peacocks. You know the peacocks? The, he's the male. And the brown ones are female. The female have to be a different colour to protect their eggs. And that one there is also a bit drab in colour because the, fe the male's more colourful. So in other words, what they're trying to say is that the females always give themselves the bad luck while the husbands stay all right. <laughs> Pregnant peacock who's all brown. Oh, there's the males. There's the male version of those ones we were just talking about. Golden pheasants. Golden pheasants. This is the male. The brown ones are the females. And she's a noisy hen. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Peppa Pig! I'm scared of the pig. Don't go close to the cage because they are known to bite. Look at that! Who is it? Look, they're eating their dinner. Two pigs there. And there's one pig over there. Is it Peppa? Yeah. And George. Okay. And then there's another one over there. Two little birds. Hi! Oh, no, it is. <laughs> I thought it was the. That's cute, though. Love birds are normally meant to be kept together. Yeah, well. Is that the one at the end? Oh, look at him. He is a big boy, isn't he? Does that just make you want a bunny rabbit even more? Yeah. Imagine having one that big, though. He's huge. Where, are you, Billy? Where, Where is he? Is he? Sheep. Squiddles. How do we go in there? Oh, okay. So the red squiddles aren't what we've seen. We've seen the normal squiddles. The red squiddles are in danger, so they're inside cages. So, like in here? Yeah. So the red squiddles are in there, the normal squiddles of what have been all around us. Mum! Mum! <laughs> Can't see them. <gasps> oh, Jeb! Why are you such a tit? Yeah. The jungle park. Jungle park. Uh, oh. Here's the. The wild ones. There's two. Where? Oh. Oh, look at him turning over in his bed. Did you see him? Oh, it's a mummy. It's a mummy. Oh, 
she's cleaning them. It's like time to be cleaned. Oh, cute. A bunny. We are not getting a bunny. We're not getting a bunny. No. You can adopt one at Acorn Farm and then it can stay yeah, there. Bring it home. No. Yeah. He's massive. Bananas. All of these ones are massive, Mom, aren't they? Why is it fancy bananas? It's just what the bananas have come in. Are you lucky bananas? <gasps> bananas! He's huge, isn't he? Yeah. He's another big. Oh, look at him. It's not a street, love, it's a farm. Three room. Uh, oh, his feathers broke. Broke his feathers, yeah. Just look at that. He's got like. He's really came over the fence. No, they fly on feet. Come on. They know where they get fed. They know where they get fed, so they won't move from here. It's called the Jungle Park. That looks so cool. Admission. Fifteen pounds a child, fifteen pounds an adult. Do you think you'd do it? Yeah. I think you'd crap out. Pounds. I bet I would. Mum, I bet I would. And Matthew's terrified of heights. It would. But look at these, they're so cool, aren't they? Like you just walk along all the next, you're all strapped on all along by the looks of it. Dun, 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 dun. Is it? Oh my god, So we got risking out being hit with a golf ball. Yeah, come on, let's go back the other way. So we no, love, you might get hit with a golf ball. So we just went through a woodland walk and ended up on a golf course. And I was like, do not walk onto that golf course with the baby. Joe's like, why not? Because golf balls are going to be flying everywhere. That's why. A little mini golf. That's cool, that isn't it? The girls have just gone to see how much the mini golf is. Gather what the girls have just shouted back to me. It's five for an adult. Six pound for an adult, five for a junior, five for a senior. Oh. So it's either six pounds or five pounds, and five pounds and four pounds. Five pounds for an adult, six pounds for an adult, five pounds for a junior, five pounds for a senior. I've had it twice. Okay, it's around five or six pounds each person. But it looks good. It's a good um, area, isn't it? Ebony's making music on a machine. Beautiful is that. This is where you get married. Joe's just been saying to the girls, if, you, if your husband cannot afford to marry you there, you don't get married. Meanwhile, we got married in a registry office. I chose it, yeah, I suppose. And a little um, social club afterwards. Only 21 and 22, wasn't yeah? You're 22, you was 21 and 22. And um, Joe worked two jobs to pay for our wedding, nobody else paid it for us. And I think it cost us about £2,000 in total, you didn't say, it? Your family have to love you. The person who turns up to marry you chose to love you. Yeah. You always remember that, guys. I, I give you that quote. Yes, I did. When I wrote it on our anniversary post. That's where it got it. Yeah. <laughs> There's also a pond here yeah, as well. <laughs> but yeah, weddings don't have to cost the earth. You know, you just yeah. Coffee in here if um, you don't want to bring a picnic. And then there's this history culture shop. It's Billy boiling in here. <gasps> Turtles on the rock. Did you not see it? Yeah. There's turtles. Come on, look. And look at the fish. It does smell like a swimming pool, doesn't it? There's fish, big massive fish, and a turtle.
like the fun fair which is actually closed five pounds each person to go on the trampoline please buy the tokens at the wheel this one is three pounds so i'm guessing it's open on the weekends and maybe the summer holidays No, it's not. That's just closed. And then it's £3 for the teacups, which I guess isn't too bad. The house in here is absolutely free. The pet and zoo is free. The, the whole entire park is free, which is amazing. So if that's all you've got to pay for and the golf and the like, the climbing activity, it's amazing, isn't it? We have all of like these events on. £5 a ticket for the greatest showman. And Ella's summertime special. And they've even got ABBA. £12 a ticket, licensed to bar, Friday the 12th of July. Are now back in the car. What an absolute lovely place that is. And it's completely free. Everything is completely free, apart from the parts, the two two parts it was, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Two golf. parts that I showed you that you did have to pay for, mini golf and the climbing experience, which is definitely worth paying for. And obviously the fun fair as well. But I didn't even know that was here. It was closed anyway. But yeah, it was it was lovely, wasn't it? Yes. What did it cost us? £3.50? Yeah. £3.50, just covering my licence plate number there. But yeah, £3.50 parking. And then I think it's £4.50 of a weekend. I think I need that for when I'm driving out to the cameras, see ya. No, yeah, well, that's only for that that ticket inspector who's tickets to that person. I don't know, someone got ticketed. I've got my They literally car. pulled in the same time as us and I come back to the car to get a nappy and they'd already been ticketed, which is crazy. Um, so yeah, now we're heading home. We've got to do the Runcorn Bridge game. Yeah, I'll be able to contest that though, because they said they didn't they get did a ticket off the machine. They did say they didn't get a ticket off the machine. And they got bank details. Yeah, but it, it does say on the online website to ring a number if there's anything fails with the ticket thing, and they'll come straight away to you. Ah, okay. So. Um, sat -nav, am I? We're using your sat-nav because it got us better, didn't okay. it? Yeah, oh, I think. Oh, Robin, look. When Robin's in here, when, hang on, when Robin's in here, when robins appear, angels are near. They sound empty. Oh, cute. That's two today we've seen now, isn't it? Yeah. Where's that um, white sponge, babe? <clears throat> Should really have that in my side, shouldn't I? Uh -huh. Baby is being touching this while she's um. No, you, Dad threw it over the seat, didn't you? Which? Yeah. Dad, you my phone your bag. What is that all over that? It looks like sneeze or 35 something. 35 minutes. 35 minutes it's saying now. Starting road. Proceed to Walton Lee Road, then continue straight on. We are home and our seatbelt cover things have arrived. Arrive. Which would have come in handy for the trip, wouldn't it? I'm going to put these on the card in a minute. So they're nice, aren't they? I think they were £7, £6 something, £7. Um... <laughs> So I got four. So there's one for the each for the girls because your neck it hurts your neck, doesn't it? So did you say hurt your neck? You're all gonna have one even if it doesn't. So just, yes, yeah. And Joe, was, I, I was like, I'll put one in the back for the boys. Joe was like, you can't do that. It's got to be matching. So if you're having one on your seat, I'll have to have one on my seat. So I was like, okay. So Joe's having one too. Um, it was a lovely day out, wasn't it? It was a lovely, lovely park. Yeah. Lovely area. I haven't parked the car up the path right now because I'm not sure if we're going out anywhere. Um, what are you looking like that for? Because we always go somewhere, don't we? We always go somewhere. But I don't know if I've got travel sickness or something, but when I sat down in my seat, I was going all dizzy and I was going, oh, I feel like I'm going to vomit. It was like aftermath no, travel I think, sickness. I think it's not because travel sickness. I think it's because you just... No, it, it happens it, it, like the other week when I was where did I drive. I think I drove up to Argenas and when I got home, I felt like I was moving. Like, like a motion. <laughs> weird. So weird. We're heading back out. We need to just jump to the town centre because Joe's in need of cake. What oh, you love? Just a little. I don't know if... Shouldn't... Because you've put Maybe that, that, so won't that it'll take me? No, because it's just like the belt. This is supposed to be shown, sure, doesn't it? I don't know. And then that stuff like that one. <laughs> Did you kneel? You, might, you might have to do the belt really the opposite way. Yeah, that's what I meant. No, I meant like tear it so like where you've put it on that way. Put the no, velcro so it like faces that way. It'll, it'll take, yeah, the velcro rubber, you know. No, I don't yeah. mean like that, right? Say so you say for instance you take it off. Yeah. Turn it upside down 
and then the, this velcro strap will be open that way oh where's my own yeah like yours <laughs> don't think yours while we're here i just put them on i don't think it'd make a difference to be fair I love that scratching your neck with my own stuff. It hasn't, yeah. I think you're actually right. I put mine on the right way, goes on wrong, I'd fix that. Can I fix mine too? See where, yeah, because yeah, I put mine on correctly. <laughs> <laughs> That's like, I put mine Isn't on it on ironic? Too. Well, that's up my seat. Don't you think? Dad's like, I rush with all these. Shh. Okay, this one is my seat. I need to make it extra comfy. Is it? Is. That's better. Yeah, that's better. Doesn't feel as clunky as well. Now that's annoying though. Or oh, I don't know. Yeah. I don't, I'd rather have that than um, the seatbelt stabbing me in the neck every. Like, because it does not leave marks on uh, your neck. No, it's cushion padded in there. It's cushion padded. Has everybody else got theirs fixed? Yeah? Yeah. Um, is Nevaeh strapped properly? Is she in the green? Yeah. <laughs> we always have to make sure she's in yeah. the green in between her legs like it highlights green if she's strapped in properly yeah let's go um where are we going to your mum's visit your mum cakes cakes we're not doing our i'm not doing another no, motorway today do i'm done leave me mum um go get some cake shopping again mom. she pushes it on her own oh, yeah. honestly we she would we've got three mini shoppers today Oh no, and you can't move it properly. It's Come on then, let's go get our shopping, babe. Oh, is it? Yeah. It goes off. Come on then. We're going treat. We are now Wait. on our way home from Sue's. We were going to get my battery died, didn't it? That's yeah. why I didn't record that. You got some bits though, didn't you? Yeah. Um, we were going to go to Aldi, but um, we thought, no, do you know what? Let's just go to our garage. Let's get home. We haven't even cooked tea yet, and it's quarter past six um i hate this junction at this time of night it just feels like everybody wants to fly out yeah watch i'll get caught out in these lights i always do oh actually actually no because i watch i'll put my foot down and then it goes red what are you playing love Someone please tell us a good radio station because we ain't got one. <laughs> Reversing up the path. you find it now. Tea is safe, finally. Oh Ten God. to eight. Ten to eight, somebody and tea. Tea was delicious. Outstanding. It was outstanding, Joe's saying. It was definitely worth waiting until eight o'clock. Joe was like, just do something simple. So I was just gonna lash some like sausages or something like that on instead. And I was like, no, we can wait. We'll just cook these chickens. It's only like 45 minutes. So we'll just have these. It was worth Upstairs it. Upstairs to bring the veil to bed. And of course, yeah. the girls always join me in the yeah. room of a night time. So does Matthew as well. But Matthew's had his little gab and he's left now, he hasn't, hasn't he? He hasn't done it for the past two days. No, he hasn't because he's been playing um, is PlayStation. PlayStation. Yeah, it's PlayStation. PlayStation? Yes, don't you touch any of Dad's paperwork, okay? Saying to Ebony, she has caught the sun 
very well today on yeah. her beautiful face. She's gone really tanned. Yeah. You just put toner on, haven't you? So that's yeah. probably why it's like all emphasised. And so have you, Renee, actually, all underneath your eyes and across your nose and everything. It's, it's fine now. She hasn't seemed to caught any, has she? Have I caught any? Uh, yeah, a bit there. Just on one side of my face? No, on both of them. Maybe that's just because I'm having on a gallbladder side, attack. On the side, you've got a little like, cheekbone. Oh, I've got a cheekbone. Ooh. So on the side, you're like pale. On the side, you're like cheekbone. very tanned. I have them like that with my arms as well. Look, can you see which arm's more tan than the other? <laughs> this one's white and this and one's that, tanned. That's the same size as your face. Uh, and yeah, this is the side that are driving, so it must be the sun um. coming through the window. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this on this hat? Who's on it? Eh. Boo! So it is bedtime, and Vo's decided to put a book hat on. So I am going to end the video because she's ready to like go on summer holidays <laughs> <laughs> and it's time for sleep. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you again soon for another video. Bye! Little